Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about something I've been getting asked a lot about lately and it's it's even popped up on one of my favorite new YouTube channels out of nowhere. It's creatine. You've seen it on TikTok, your buddy at the gym. I won't stop raving about it. And let's be honest, if you've ever walked through a supplement aisle, you probably wonder, what the heck is in all those giant tubs of powder? Now, some people swear creatine is a miracle. Others think it's basically powdered steroids sold in neon containers. <laughs> and spoiler alert, it's not steroids and you don't have to buy it from a guy named Chad at your gym who only wears uh, stringer tank tops and calls everyone bro. Sorry, Chad. <laughs> but here's the real question. What happens when you combine oh. creatine with the GLP-1s like Wagovi or Zepbound, Majaro, um, 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 Ozempic? Is it safe? Will it sabotage your weight loss? Or, or could it actually help? Is it okay for your kidneys? <laughs> Stick around because we're breaking down the science, the myths, and the reality of mixing creatine with GLP-1 medications. And at the end, I'll share the most surprising benefit of creatine, one that has absolutely nothing to do with six-pack abs. Well, first things first. What, what, what is creatine? It's not a steroid. It's not some underground supplement only bodybuilders take. In fact, creatine is something your body naturally makes, just like the GLP-1s. It's stored in your muscle and acts like a rechargeable battery, giving you uh, quick, quick bursts of energy uh, when you sprint or when you lift weights or real life example. When you're sprinting through the airport because your boarding group um, just got called and you just got through the uh, TSA checkout line. <laughs> Most people supplement with creatine by um, mixing a small scoop that used to be higher, but now it's three to five grams per scoop into water each day. It's tasteless, it's cheap, it's safe. And here's the kicker. Creatine is one of the most researched supplements on the planet. We're talking decades and decades of studies, thousands of participants, and consistent results. So what does it actually do? It helps you work harder in the gym, recover faster, and build or maintain muscle mass. All of this while decreasing the fat content in your body. Regular people can benefit too. It's basically giving your body extra fuel for physical performance, and as we'll see later, even cognitive performance. Bet you didn't know that. So no, Tony, creatine isn't magic dust. Okay, you got me. It's science-backed energy support, and it may be more helpful on Wigovi than you realize. First off, never take creatine before discussing the risks and benefits you have with your doctor. It's not for everyone. With that being said, this video is from the lens of someone already being confirmed by their doctor that they're a good candidate for creatine supplementation. So let's get started. Here's a million dollar question. Does creatine cancel out or enhance Iwegovi or Zepbound results? The short answer is no, not directly. Creatine doesn't directly interfere with how these medications regulate appetite and digestion. They do actually enhance the blood sugar, though. They're, they're, not, they're not in direct competition with it, but they help regulate it by some studies, and they operate on totally different systems in your body. But here's uh, where people panic. Creatine makes your muscles hold a little extra water, and that's a part of how it works. When you step on the scale, you might see it go up a pound or two. And if you're on Wigovi, your brain immediately goes, oh no, the medication is not working and I'm gaining weight. Relax. It's not fat, it's water. And it's actually a good sign that creatine is doing its job. In fact, creatine can support Wigovi by helping you hold onto lean muscle mass while you're losing fat. And that's huge because muscle is your metabolic engine, like I've said many times before. The more you keep, the more calories you burn at rest even when you're binge watching Netflix. Hopefully not binging on the junk food. So instead of thinking creatine undoes your progress, think of it as a trusty sidekick. Wigovi helps reduce fat, creatine helps protect muscles, so resistance training sucks less and you can do more. Together, they're like Batman and Robin for your metabolism. We had to trust each person to do his job. That's what being partners is all about. Let's move on to some myths that people believe. And now, Let's clear those myths up because creatine has a lot of bad PR. Number one, creatine makes you puffy and bloated. 
That used to be true back when people did a loading phase of 20 grams a day for a couple of days. And they'd slam scoops of powder and basically walk around like human water balloons. And I've even seen a recipe for creatine pancakes. But modern dosing is 3 to 5 grams daily without a loading phase. And it gives you all the benefits without the puff. No, no one's going to notice but you and your scale. Myth number two. Creatine damages your kidneys. Now, not true for healthy people or people who use it correctly. Study after study confirms safety. If you already have kidney disease or on the way to kidney disease or at high risk for kidney disease, you should absolutely be cautious. But for the average person, creatine is no more harmful than eating a steak. Number three, creatine is only for bodybuilders. Nope, again. Athletes, everyday gym goers, even older adults, benefits, even doctors, nerdy doctors on YouTube <laughs> can get benefits from these medications. It can help with strength training or recovery. And yes, even cognitive functions have been shown to improve on creatine. The limit here may be kidney function. So always check before getting started. Like I just said, especially the older you are. Myth number four, creatine will turn me into the rock overnight. Listen. If that were true, half of us would be hulking out of our shirts by now. Sadly, or maybe thankfully, it doesn't work that way. <laughs> Creatine helps, but it's not a superhero serum. Sorry, Marvel fans. You're not going to turn into Iron Man. Let's talk about side effects and safety. What should you watch out for if you're on Wigovi or Zepbound and considering creatine? Let's talk first, GI upset. If Wegovy already gives you nausea, slamming down a giant creatine scoop on an empty stomach is a bad idea. Start with a small dose. Maybe mix it into a smoothie and see how your body reacts. Next up is hydration. Because creatine pulls water into your muscles, Wegovy can make you forget to drink water. Combine those and you're looking at headaches, constipation, and fatigue. A brand new way to fall into the hydration trap. Solution. Keep a body of water with you at all times. You should be doing this anyway. Hydration is non-negotiable. Keep up with your water intake. Next up is kidney health. I've said this a couple times already and I'm going to keep saying it. It's not a huge risk, but it's a risk if you're at high risk. If you have existing kidney issues like foamy urine or swelling with less urine production all of a sudden than, you, than, than you're used to, please talk to your doctor first. Otherwise, for most healthy people, creatine is a safe long-term option. Overall, creatine is one of the safest supplements you can take. When combined with Wigobi, the main thing is awareness, hydration, monitor your body, and dose reasonably. No creatine pancakes. Think of it as, a, as adding a little turbo boost to your weight loss journey. And here's one of my favorite parts about creatine, some of the hidden benefits we mostly don't talk about. Um, it, it's, it's not just for the gym. Yes, it helps with muscle performance and losing fat, but research suggests creatine may also support brain health. That's where the cognitive function comes in. And that's right, your gray matter loves creatine too. Studies show benefits for memory, focus, mental fatigue, and even resilience under stress are increased even as we get older, especially when we're older. Creatine can also help burn more fat and increase lean muscle, like I've said already. It also has shown improvement in glucose control and lowering hemoglobin A1C in the long term. So, no, creatine won't just help you push through one more rep. It might also help you push through one more Zoom meeting, finish that project on time, or get through the afternoon without reaching for your fifth iced latte. So imagine losing fat on Wegovy, preserving muscle with creatine, and boosting your mental sharpness all at once. For some folks, that's not just weight loss. That's actually total performance optimization. And we optimize every time we get a chance. So if you thought creatine was just for the gym bros, Flexing the mirror, think again. This little scoop of powder might be one of the most versatile and safe tools you can add to your healthcare journey. And before you go, I'm not going to hold you, but let's talk about shopping. If you're going to add creatine, get evaluated by your doctor for appropriateness. I've said this and get it from a legit source. That's the part I haven't said. Don't buy it from the lady at the dollar store who, who says she also got an extra um, Wegovy pen in the back by the paper plates. And the paper towels. Don't go for that one. 
All right, don't don't buy from the lady at the dollar store. I know she's a lovely lady. I'm, I'm sorry, lady at the dollar store. I don't mean to talk about you that bad every time, but it's the truth. You can get creatine. It's, it's like maybe 15, 20 bucks for a tub. That lasts for a couple of months if you're doing it right. And if someone's charging you triple that or selling it out the trunk of, the, of their car in a gym parking lot, you're not buying creatine. You may be, maybe not. You're not. You don't know where you get it from. You, you You're buying, definitely buying some regret. So stick to trusted supplement brands. Keep it simple. Creatine monohydrate is the gold standard and save your money for actual groceries. The extra money. Help doesn't come from shady deals. It comes from consistency, quality, commitment, and smart choices. Hey, by the way, my YouTube analytics show that only about 20% of you watching right now are actually subscribed. And if you've gotten this far and you're enjoying this content and learning how to make smarter, safer health choices and better purchases, please hit that subscribe button. It, it's free and it helps the channel and it means I can keep making and taking these deep dives into lifestyle medicine for you and with you. So let's wrap it up. Creatine and Wegovy mix just fine. They don't cancel each other out and you might see a tiny bump on the scale, but that's just water most times, not fat. In the long term, creatine helps you preserve muscle, which means a faster metabolism, stronger workouts and more calories burned, even at rest. Add in the bonus of possible brain benefits, and it's one of the most underrated supplements you can take. Hmm. I've never said that before, right? <laughs> if you want to maximize your results, grab my free GLP-1 bootcamp. It includes my nutrition guide and 14 days of practical science-backed tips you can use right away. The link's in the description below, so go ahead and check it out. I'm sure you will benefit. Stay healthy, stay informed, and I will see you soon.